Three Pointers TV, T's at the Tolerton. Big up Dubs and big up Marty. I'm with Curtis. Arsenal have gone over there to the toilet. Big up Curtis, by the way. He's like, listen, me too, man. Just about scraped it, man. I don't know about that, man. I Just think, about. I don't think we necessarily scraped it. Look, we well, we hit, listen, man, they the, hit the post. We had they the, hit the post, was it? They had the first goal disallowed. They, they, yeah, to offside. be fair, it could know, have been a different game, Curtis. There was an offside decision, obviously, for could them. Have been a different obviously, game. there was a penalty kick for them as well, obviously. Unfortunately, obviously, with Declan Rice, you know, making contact, as you can see, doing a penalty. And obviously, you know, unfortunate with David Rea, you know, I don't know what he was doing there because there was no pressure. Like, their forward was in plenty of space. There was plenty of space between their forward and, and Rea. He should have controlled him more. But, you know, people, they make mistakes. But let's focus on the positives today. Our forwards, Mikhail Saka, he's at it again. You know, the first goal, you know, he falls, I think he falls in there. It was an own goal, wasn't it? I think it was yeah, the first goal was an own goal, goal, yeah. Given Tottenham Hotspur. So the second goal, Silky, that was obviously again Bikeo. There you go, and Silky. Kai Havertz. <laughs> Was again, that's you know, it. It pops 65 million. Up. And, you know, like we say with the midfield, we can clearly see 60 million, see, not 65. Yeah, 60 million down the drain. Uh -huh. But look, he's scoring goals. Our midfield again, they've done it again. That midfield, pet, that honesty, midfield maestro. That's what you know, we've been calling out. I've been like for several games, we've been calling out for C, Thomas Partey, Declan Rice, and Martin Odegaard. And we could see why because it's the progressive forward passing when we have the because even though. Thomas Partey six, you know, and he's a you know hold, holding midfielder. It gives obviously Declan Rice the freedom to explore and roam. And I feel like collectively the whole team play, you know, express themselves. O Odegaard, that's probably going to be that's got to be one of the best performances I've seen of Odegaard this season. May you know, and Trossard, magical, Trossard looked comfortable. On the, Trossard and Saka were causing their fullbacks all sorts of problems all game, and we got him. Mane looked alright when he came on. I'm trying to think to be uh, Kivio or oh, any other subs. Kivio, you see, Kivio got some I see minutes. We'll see when he, when he came from Tommy Essu. But almost in that words, let's focus on the positives. Fingers crossed. You know, three games a, to go, guys. It's a lot of pressure. Who knows? Obviously, Man I see it play. Oh, they're about to start. No, the I did say obviously after the Newcastle and Liverpool game at the Emirates, I did say I did think Manchester City and Liverpool would win. Obviously, Liverpool, I think they're kind of out of the race. However, Manchester City, the pressure's on them. Obviously, I know they did beat Brighton the other day. And obviously, they're, going, you know, they're playing for us. They could beat for us. But who knows, for us to turn up. And obviously, you know, the Spurs game. There's all eyes on the Spurs City game because Spurs do have a good record against City. However, City are, uh, obviously, Spurs are playing poor. But come on, let's focus, guys. We've got to think what we've done as, as a club, as a team, right? Two back to back eight finishes. And then we finish fifth. Then we finish second. And this is when we finish second. And we, you know, if we go out and get a clinical number nine, we could certainly win that Premier League title or UCL. I'm proud of the boys. You know, I know people, you know, they call us bottlers. The Premier League title was in our hands. But they're not saying the same about Liverpool, who also pushed them. But onwards and upwards, obviously, you know, all eyes on Man City, obviously, are playing later for us. And obviously, remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel, shout out 3 TV, T's, Martin Dubs, and join us next week when we're at Bournemouth. Yeah, Bournemouth at home. Bournemouth at home. Up the Gunners. Come on, you Gunners!